Holy shit, that's loud, bro. It's having so much fun being in the locker room again and being the All leader right, of um, the team that could go to the playoffs. Take the handoff, Flacco. Deep shot on first down, looking for the big play. Clutch, I can have this. It's having so much fun being in the locker room again and being the leader of a team that could go to the playoffs. Take the handoff, Flacco. Deep shot on first down, looking for the big play. And it's caught by Cooper. Now, the majority of y'all said there was a record broken by the Browns this game. Let's see what it is. This time it's going to be Jerome Ford. It's a blowout. This is a blowout? Who the fuck is requesting blowouts, especially a team that has a star quarterback that's injured, C.J. Stroud, and then the Browns? Don't nobody want to watch these shitty Browns if it's not a close game. All right, we're not watching this. Thank you. Y'all spammed the shit out of this earlier. Browns. Oh, save me from a 36 to... uh. 22 blowout. What was the record? Amari Cooper with 11 catches, 265? Bro, it just shows how weak the NFL is, though. I ain't gonna lie to you. Amari Cooper getting this stat line is crazy. He's been, Amari Cooper's been in the NFL since I was in like 10th or 11th grade, I think. He's always been a consistent, casual receiver. He used to play for the Cowboys. Tony Romo days. All right. That's the record y'all wanted me to see? Yeah, he's been a consistent casual. I don't think Amari Cooper made one Pro Bowl this entire time he's been in the league. Amari Cooper's a four-time Pro Bowler. 